Cunard building was built in 1914, completed in 1970. Uh, soon after Cunard moved into the building um, to operate the fleet. The Three Graces are built on St George's Dock Basin and the first building to be built out of the Three Graces was the Port of Liverpool. Then the Liver building was built and then of course Cunard. We've still got a piece of the dock. I think it's the only piece now in Liverpool that you can see. Cunard buildings are grade two listed star building. It was designed by Willink and Thickness. Some of the designs you can see around you now are the golden eagles uh, in, in the corners of the roof, which commemorate the first postal service between Britain and America, which was carried on Cunard ships. Cunard is wider at the back than it is at the front, and people think it was because it was built to be the shape of a ship, but it wasn't, it was just the space that we were left to build the building in. The doors behind me, um, every Cunard passenger had to come through those doors. This was the check-in area for Cunard. Once uh, your tickets had been checked and uh, we knew what type of a passenger you were, you were then directed to a different part of the building. There, there would have been many thousands of people, depending on what ship they were, were going on, of course. Any of the fleet at that time um, would, would use Liverpool passenger ships and cargo ships. The passenger terminal would have serviced floating palaces, uh, Mauritania, Aquitania and Lusitania. It was very rare in, in them days that there wasn't a Cunard ship at the dock or waiting to come into the dock. The boardroom was where all the major decisions were taken for uh, the future Cunard ships uh, that were going to be built and the ships that were in service at that time. And most importantly, the Queen Mary was designed from that fifth floor boardroom. There are some um, Conference suites, we use them for now, but they were on the sixth floor, they were for the first class passengers, where they were taken up to the sixth floor and entertained whilst waiting to board the ship. There is a baggage suite downstairs in the basement, um, a very, very large room, so you can understand the capacity of the baggage that was coming into the building. There was a train that used to come into the building delivering the baggage from um, the likes of the Adelphi Hotel where first class passengers would stay the night before. I think we, we, we do have ghosts. Um, I've never seen them but it has been reported to me by our night security staff um, after midnight. They've heard a lady singing. Um, because they're on their own in the building they don't use the lifts so they walk up the stairs and when they get to the second floor, they open the ladies' toilets and the singing stops. 